welcome to my channel today we will talk about the behaviors in the script and what is the behavior and what's the use of it so let's go to manage f and search for the behaviors let me provide my password okay behaviors okay so it's already one behavior is there let's delete it and create so the behavior is basically used for the fields okay as you can see the behaviors functionality allows you to define a how fields behave of for issue in a given project or issue context for example make a field mandatory based on another field data so uh, like uh, you can make a field mandatory based on other field data and all you can make a field uh, uh, read only based on your workflow status and all so we'll check how to do that one so let me show you one example so i'm creating the ticket jira test project request type anything come down create the ticket so while it's creating come here and create the behavior give anything like hide field or make field read only okay create mapping which project jira test project i am working and uh, for which issue type i am just looking for request issue type okay click on add mapping so based on this one the you can select multiple projects and all issue types also create so it will create now which workflow you want to use so come here what i am doing uh, see uh in this workflow if i'm changing waiting approval let me add jira sme jira kt these two approval okay i have added now i can see these approvals are here but i make this approval what i want i make a mandatory oh sorry read only okay in other like when you are approving it okay so in approval it should not you cannot change it but while giving only when your ticket is in waiting for approval then only you can change it like see i can uh, remove it right now like this but i don't want this behavior when it's only in waiting for approval then only i want to change it but if it's there in another state i don't want to change it okay so come here which workflow it's using come here go to good project setting okay go to the workflow which workflow it's using let's see go down workflow for jira test okay just come here come here suggestion workflow for jira okay which field i want i want approval field this is approval field come here click on add make field read only okay which condition i want when or expect so i expect means only in that condition it will work a condition will true behavior will happen when it's a true okay except workflow step when waiting for approval when the ticket is been waiting for approval i want to make this editable otherwise i want to make a read only okay click on save just come here refresh the page see now it will become read only see it's not working but if you will change it will not work any other status see it's a read only closed let's close the ticket let's reopen the ticket 
again you will check approval is not working it's a read only but if it's waiting for approval you can change it okay uh, i don't want any will right now but here i can change it now jira kt so like this you can make a field read only so there are multiple behaviors are available okay but it will work when only in the project in a specific issue type or all the issue type you can add multiple projects al also but it's going to work in the field only okay you need to take care of these things any of the field you can select it so thank you for watching